heavy. Bored. That's what I witnessed in my yeah, workshop. I think we... I think it, it depends on the, I mean, we talked about, I talked about this in the first episode. Like that's, I think what you're getting at is true. Like there, when I think workshop culture, I think there, are, that means there are sets of rules. Like there are rules and etiquette and things that are expected. And some of that means that there are words that are off limit. Like there's censorship that happens in the workshop. Like there are topics that are off limits. There are subjects off limits according to a racial hierarchy, you know, kind of thing. Like, where like you can't talk about certain subjects or I mean you can right but like in the workshop setting it's deemed not allowed type thing it's against the rules uh and it's really weird and I mean everybody's feeling it uh it's part of the reason I wanted to start this segment is because everybody feels this this is part of workshops this is just what it is now and uh it's making it kind of suck uh for the most part but there are these kinds of rules and like you said right away it's pc right politically correct but it's politically correct according to only one set of politics and you don't feel like you're actually getting real feedback because if all of your feedback is filtered through all these weird social constraints then it's not about the writing anymore so i don't even know if the writing's good anymore you know <laughs> absolutely that's like the rules i call it the dnc rubric to grading art and you see this even in reviews of movies you could pick up a copy of the new yorker you can read the book reviews well they're taking the books to task not according to the craft or like what's on the page they're taking it to task according to this set this rubric that how well it adheres to a certain political ideology and you're graded according to that and not according to what's on the page. And you see this, you know, we're recording this on July 6th, uh, but it's like. Inner. Resources, American resources. Being bored. You know, some activities are uh, intentional, right? It shows such a lack Heavy. of gratitude for life forward. I, I aspire to put my shit. Bored. I am heavy, heavy, heavy. Bored. Has your night sweats and the day sweats, pal? Pal, I do. 